Would you ever eat human feces? NASA, they're working on a new project. They've been awarded 1.6 million or 200,000 a year for six years. One of these projects that they're working on to turn human poop into edible products. Well, this project studies, quote, the innovative early stage technologies that will address high priority needs of the American space program. So what they're saying is there's a need for people to eat shit, essentially. The synthetic biology for recycling human waste program, that's what it's known as, into food. It's also known, uh, the project, it hopes to turn astronauts' own waste into food, Jose. They're doing this because they want to be able to travel to Mars eventually and not have to turn around and come back. They want to be able to stay up. It's all about sustaining these astronauts long term. They're, they're looking at the long game and they're saying in order for them to do this, we're going to have to make sure that they can eat their own poop. So they're competing with the quality of food from airlines. I think it's <laughs> great. I think that it shows the commitment of, of the human race to go to space even if we have to eat our own shit. Well, we're going to get to Mars. But we have to get creative at the same time because you know the amount of time that it's going to take to move a crew from the Earth to Mars, it's not like you can send another ship to refuel. So they do have to you know, make sure that they can store enough food, but that doesn't become an issue because of, of the cargo transportation of it. So they have to resort to these very innovative uh, procedures to try to make the most out of every single thing in that ship. Literally, they're trying to, Mark Blenner of Clemson University, by the way, he's heading this study where they're, where they're doing these research. I don't know who, by the way, they would have to taste test their products to make sure that they're edible a enough. A chunk of the grant is going to go know, for the, the I would, I would hope so, that they get, a, they get a major part of that money. This is NASA's press release, their official statement about this project. They say that technology drives exploration and investments in these technologies and technologists is essential to ensure NASA and the nation have capabilities necessary to meet the challenges we will face as we journey to Mars. The difficult... The, the faculty selected and their colleagues help assure robust university research community dedicated to advanced space technology development. So they're taking this seriously. Yeah. And who knew there was big business in um, turning shit into reusable products, namely food. It sounds outrageous, but there's, there's, there's science behind it. And it's mm -hmm. because the body does not process and breaks down or absorbs. 100% of the nutrients of the food that we put into. So our excrement have some nutritional value to it, you know, surprisingly, but have they do have to figure the out, the, exactly, they, they have woo. to figure out a way to separate those, those molecules and, and, and bacteria that is toxic to the human body and still be able to recapture and recycle right. the nutrients that then broke down in the process. I think it's very, very interesting. Um, I hope they get good testers. <laughs> would you mind eating your own or no, would I'll you inform. eat somebody else's? I'll be here informing to our Oh, I our see. You won't audience. eat any no, of it. No, I won't be eating I that. I don't know if I could, I mean, my own, I could probably do it if it were really recycled. Recycle, well Maybe. packaged. You never know. Monthly subscription. That would be funny. <laughs> That's the future. That's the future that they're talking about. They're, they do these technologies and then they sell it as an app. It'll be we, fun to see. We'd love to know what you think at home about this NASA project. Uh, do you like it? Do you support it? Is it cool or is it just absolutely disgusting? Log on, post those comments below while you're at it. Be sure to check out the rest of our channel and, of course, subscribe to the Lip TV 2 for more.